seat itself is pretty comfortable and this backrest is nice and fluffy. It's like, it really is like you're sitting in a lazy boy. The only problem is like- What I don't understand is why these other, all these other YouTubers show this great, fantastic luxury bus from Kathmandu to Pokhara or Pokhara to Kathmandu, but yet they don't tell you the bus company. So we're at the bus parking lot of Pokhara where we got dropped off and I see a bunch of buses where we can get our bus back to Kathmandu, but we need to find out which one is the luxury one, which one is the one with the comfy seats. So we're going to go around these buses and take a peek and see what seats look comfortable because I know what it should look like and then hopefully we can find our bus back to Kathmandu. Yeah, I mean, this looks like a nice seats, right? Yes, yeah, so this is one of them. So Swift Holidays, I think I remember that name. I can't really see. I, I imagine see it's nice. Yeah, that's definitely one of the buses. There's another bus that has these like cushiony movie theater looking seats. Uh, this one would be a good option, but let's see if we can find that other one. Also, we're here in the afternoon, so all those buses are probably gone for the day. But let's see, they might have like backup ones. Yeah, those are comfortable too, but not the movie theater ones. And the reason we need these comfortable seats is because it's going to be like a nine hour journey. So. You can charge your Tesla here. It's an EV charging station. That looks like normal bus seats. A sleeper coach what yeah all these over here are just normal seats like I think we had going to Langtang but this sleeper bus looks interesting Un unfortunately we can't see the seats because all the blinds are drawn uh, I guess we're gonna have to go with that Swift one unless we just walk up to the offices and see if they have a picture of what their bus looks like well oh, wait this is actually open we could uh see for ourselves how comfortable the seats are <laughs> let's go are we gonna get in trouble well i don't think we're gonna get deported okay oh someone's slippers are there is someone is someone living here oh he's there he's having a little bit of a sleep I'm sure those are the workers, but if we go to their office, I'm sure we can ask, hey, can we go look at your bus? Can so, we spend the night in the bus? That's the real question. Yeah. All right. Let's go see if we can see how much a ticket is and then see if we can actually go sit on it and try it out. Sit on the bus? Yeah. No, I meant sit on the seat. Yeah. Sitting on the top of the bus probably wouldn't be too comfortable for nine hours. No. So yeah, this is the Swift holiday. So we could see if, you know, how much those tickets cost. Wait, does Swift have anything nicer than that? Or that's as nice as it gets? No, I think that's as nice as it gets for that company. Um, again, What's the other one? I, I feel like it's called like Open Nepal. I literally had to take screenshots of people's YouTube videos because again, they don't explain or they don't say who these companies are, but. They're not here. People aren't going to these YouTubers for, you know, helpful guides and tips and tricks. They just want to see bikini shots. That's all they want. That's true. Namaste. 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 Good. We're trying to find a comfortable bus. Yes, you have the buses? You work for Swifty Travels? No, I Okay, we'll come see you afterwards, okay? Hello, namaste. 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 Yes, sir. We are looking for comfortable luxury bus to, uh, where are we going? Kathmandu. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I saw you have a bus right there. Yeah, this is the guy. Yeah, can we go inside and sit on the seat to see how it feels? Yeah, sure. Yeah? Sure. I gotta see if it's comfortable because it's a long journey. Yeah? yeah. yeah? Sure. <laughs> okay. I think it was open, but I didn't want to go in. It's okay if I go in? Sure, you can go. We can go in? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So we're going to go look. Uh, how much is it? 1,600 rupees. 1,600 rupees. And it's like maybe eight, nine hours? If you go the morning, yeah? morning or the night? Oh, morning is better. Yeah. This is the night going. Yeah. And but the next one in the morning, in the another. It's not same, different, but seat is the same. Okay, the seats are the same. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. The, the this would have one. Okay, but the same not seats. This one or this. The one on the left. Okay. Yeah, and the sofa. Yeah, sofa seats. Yeah. Same yeah. one. Yeah. Same like this one. Yeah. Okay. This that's the night one. Okay, that same price. 
Yeah. What time does it leave in the morning? Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock in the morning. Ooh, we like that because we don't want to go super early. <laughs> okay, we, we can go look at seats. We'll be back. Okay. Daniela. Do you take a visa or just uh, cash? Cash. Okay, no problem. But let's let's go uh, explore the Swift Holiday bus. Yeah. They have a night bus. Yeah. So that's why it's here because this is the only nighttime bus. This is a nighttime bus. Yeah. So this is leaving tonight as opposed to most of the buses that leave in the morning. Yeah. We've done a night bus before. It's not ideal. <laughs> it should be quiet. Us. And there's two guys sleeping and we were able to go in and out quietly without both of them <laughs> the key is we're not in the united states so we're not in a dangerous country where if you intrude or break and enter you're going to get shot so i felt like we were relatively safe going for it i just wanted to i don't want to disturb them they're obviously going to do the night shift tonight so they have to sleep during the day uh but yeah comfortable seats charging warts i'd say this works before we buy let's see what oh. the other guy has to offer since uh I promise we'd come back. And you never do that. I never do that. <laughs> All right, we have returned, my friends. Yes, no, no stay. Stay. welcome. Thank Which you. Which bus do you have? Well, I have this kind of bus. I have no, no. You want the which sofa seat one or you yeah. want the, how many people? When you would like to do? Just two. When you would like to do? Friday morning. Friday morning. Today is. Uh, Wednesday. Sit down beside. Yes, yeah, no okay. yeah. Wednesday. Oh, after tomorrow. Day after tomorrow, yes. Okay, so you want to go 28. Yeah, so for C, yeah, you have? Okay. I will I will try to get you one. If not, then I will talk on the way. Okay. Where are you from, USA? USA. Ah, uh, Nepal. Nepal. Nepal number one. Uh, why does nobody have a Nepal shirt like I do? This oh. is the nicest shirt. Yeah. I don't see any of you guys representing yeah. Nepal like I'm representing Nepal. Yeah, yeah, come yeah, on, yeah. guys. Yeah, you sh this would look great on you. Right. Yeah. Oh, you come on. Right. Someone, we went to a restaurant yesterday and someone thought he was a Nepal cricket player. Cricket, yeah. So they thought he was a cricket player You're because right. nobody wears the shirt. Yes. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you been trekking already? Yeah, we went to Long Tang. We didn't okay, go with a guide though. We went uh, right before we had to get the guide. Uh, yeah. So like the we week before they changed the law, we had to go have a guide. Yeah. That's when we went. You been to Long Tang before? No. No. Okay. Yeah. So we did like three days up. We hung out in King Jangupa, and then three days back. It was our first ever trek. In Lang Tang. So it's beautiful. Yeah, nice place. Yeah. Okay. If not, the next door has it too. So. We yeah, they have it. Uh, yeah. A good seat? Good seat, yeah, we just tried the bus now. Yeah, these sofa buses. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Morning bus or evening yeah, bus? Yeah, morning bus for Friday. Okay, then you know. yeah. yeah, we said we'd come back and see you, so yeah, we wanted yeah, to honor that. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. All the best, sir. Yes. Have a great day, everybody. Good seats. Yeah. Very comfortable. Your uh, workers are sleeping, so we tried to be very quiet. When do you want to leave? Uh, Friday? Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, no, no.
Not possible. What? Yeah, already pulled. It's like two days away. How how early do you buy the tickets? I end up so my uh, my office in the many from Pokhara in the three office. Mm -hmm. And got one to one of peace and the Lubini one of peace and sit on one one of peace in the all of us in the way in the system uh -huh. and they booked the entire uh, um dang. and we have possible in the this in the night was in the possible on the twenty eighth? Yeah. Night. What time does it leave? Seven o'clock. And it gets there what time? Five o'clock. Ugh, it's not ideal. Do you have space Thursday morning? Or no? Thursday means in the tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow morning. Tomorrow I think no possible. Uh, About Thursday night? Huh? Thursday night you have? Thursday night? Yeah. Thursday night means tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow night, yes. Tomorrow night, possible. You have? Yeah. The bad seat. In the back. Hello? Dang, we're like two days early. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go to a thing. I mean, we can see what these other guys have. Oh. Dang. I mean, yeah, so... I didn't think we needed to book it that early. I mean, it's like oh. the nicest bus in the entire country. <laughs> I guess. And I guess oh. it's a long journey and other people wouldn't just... We just I mean, not like we're waiting until oh, last minute, it's like the, oh, not like the day before. Yes, in advance of the you to the and go to the and go to the and No, he never said he had Friday morning. Yeah. We never actually asked him. Yeah. Yeah. Namaste! Do you have a tourist bus to Katmandu? Sofa seat? Yeah? Uh, do you have Friday morning? Yes. You do? Uh, you mean the after tomorrow? Yeah, the after tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Uh, two person? Two people, yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, because every other place you've been to in Nepal, they say just go the day before, no problem. Mm -hmm. Seems like uh, there is no sitting on the sofa. And not for tomorrow either, right? What about 29? Anything the day after? Saturday? 29? Yes. Okay, what seats? Your picture? Which one? B? Which one? These two? Where's the front? This is front? Yeah. Over here? These two seats? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, how much? Oh, so, 1600 also? And then it looks like this? Yeah. Like this one? No? It's like, what are you, crazy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yes or no? You sure? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So those are the cushiony seats that I did see originally. Uh, this is how people go by on YouTube, these, this sofa bus right here. <laughs> okay. These seats look exactly like this because it literally is like an American lazy boy. Yeah. You promise it's this one? Okay. <laughs> look at this cool guy. He would never lie to us. Yeah. <laughs> yes? Comfortable. Sofa seat, yeah? Like movie theater. Do you have movie theater too? Movie in the in the bus? Uh, yes, movie also. Yes. Movie like that. Huh? Let's go to study this. Wait, legit, have a movie. Yeah. Not movie. Ah. Oh. One is the first. Okay, so you have the sofa seat. It has AC. Yes. Um, sixteen hundred. We just have to extend our Airbnb, but I'd rather do that than the night. I can't imagine that it's going to be a problem. <laughs> um, yeah, we don't want to do night bus. I can't sleep on a any bus or train at night. So, yeah. Yeah. okay, we book it, Dana. Yeah, we will do Saturday morning. And we come here. Yeah. When we ride on the bus, will I come out looking as cool as you with cool glasses? Sorry. 
after riding the bus, will I become as cool as you are? You look very cool. <laughs> it's funny because Nepal has a different calendar. So we're actually in the year 2080, but I doubt this bus is from 60 years ago. And what color is the bus? Blue Baba. Blue Baba. Yeah, I'll just come here and I'll show you. This what time? It, bus leaves at 8 in the morning. Like 7:30. Uh, yes, 7:30, 7:30. So it wasn't the original company that we wanted, and it wasn't the original day that we wanted. But those seats look super comfortable, and it's just a day later. Uh, it's not like we're flying out on Saturday, so we still have a couple of days to work with. And um, so yeah, hopefully it's a really nice, comfortable ride. It's not going to be the the night bus because I don't want to sleep on the bus at night or anything like that. So let's see how the bus journey actually is. Okay, we made it out to the tourist bus center. Now we gotta look for our Blue Baba. Uh, bus to get back to Kathmandu and if we can't find it the guy with the cool glasses should be at this Lotus Center so we could ask him for help here. The real question is are they the comfy seats? So. Yeah well it looks like white sofas. Oh okay yeah yeah. Nice. I don't see your face. No my face. Alright this is hard when Vlogging. We never do date. We never do our like, travel days. So I have all the bags. And we got to give the people what they want. Namaste. Namaste. It's free, yeah. It's free? Yeah, no. Oh, free. okay. Yeah. When you got a free one, we'll come back for it. <laughs> you can take two pieces. Buy that one, get one free. Yeah. You, get you one got free. Bogo? Yeah, very nice bread, yeah. How much is your bread? That's 50, 80, 100, different, different. Yeah. Many <coughs> How much is the Bogo? Burger. How much is BOGO? Buy one, get one. Uh, you can take uh, this one, uh, two piece steak, uh, 150, then it's one piece, one piece free I give you. You want any bread? How much is it? It's, it's... 80, 80 rupees per piece, then you can be piece, two piece steak, one, one piece I give you free. That's but, not BOGO. But we're only two people. I don't need <laughs> three pieces of bread, I'm gonna get two packs. No, you can take it part of the way, no problem. On the way, in Kathmandu, five, six o'clock. So. Yeah, you know we're gonna get to Kathmandu at five o'clock? Yeah, four, four, five o'clock. He's our driver. Yeah. He's gonna stop selling these and drive. Every day, every which bus uh, yeah. then in Kathmandu yeah. available? I know. How yeah. about we get three piece, one free, and I give it to him. Okay. 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 One sixty, one for you, one for me, and one for this man. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's do that. Two get, I give you one piece free. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Bogo. I feel like I'm at Publix, but in I'm in Nepal. In the street. Which anyone? Anyone you can choose. Yes, you want to. Where are you from? We're from America. America, nice country, yeah? Very nice. Americani. Enjoy your bread, my friends. Okay. And where are you from? Lakeside. Lakeside. You're from Chicago? Lakeside, Chicago? Yes. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. Namaste. Bye bye. Thank you, my friends. It's more, it's a little warm too and soft, so that should be good. Nice. God bless you. Bye bye. Bye bye. I don't think you have time to go get cash. That's okay. Well, no, it's not supposed to leave till eight. We we have we have food now, so we yeah. don't need cash. Well, we yeah. That could be our lunch. Okay. <laughs> I don't think it's okay. Let's get our we can get our stuff though on, right? Is it leaving or is it maybe just moving a little bit? This is a luxury bus. All right, so I ran to the ATM to try to get a little bit more money, but the ATM was off, which is good because I ran there and I ran back. And when I got back, now the bus is leaving. It's 7.38 in the morning. Literally, I asked about five minutes ago, the bus driver, as I was walking out, what time are we leaving? We're leaving at eight? He said, yeah. And this joker is leaving 22 minutes early. So it's a good thing, I guess the ATM was closed. We have our bread now that we got from our friend this morning, so we're not going to starve to death, but it'd be nice to have a little bit more cash for the way back. Okay, every time we're on a bus, we totally get motion sickness. Like, it gets real, real bad sometimes. So we have our motion sickness pills here. Usually take it an hour in advance, and I think we waited until last minute because we wanted to have a little bit of food, plus we're not supposed to leave for 20 minutes, so hopefully it's not too crazy by the time the motion sickness medicine kicks in. And, uh, you know, we don't have any really embarrassing moments because we get really, really sick to our stomach. So, let's see. It's like you're sitting in a lazy boy. The only problem is like you're 
sitting in a lazy boy, but like your friend is right in front of you. Like so, like there's not as much leg room as like other buses that we've had. Like it's no like turkey bus, that's for sure. But uh, let's see if I can maybe lean it back a little bit if this guy doesn't get upset and at least get some decent leg room here. I think you can put your foot under the flap. I mean, I guess it helps a little bit, but then my knees are still bouncing up against this bar right here. So nobody's a uh, six foot. How old are you? How, how, how old are you? How tall are you? Yeah. No, I'm I'm 6'1", yeah, so I know I'm taller than the average in Nepali, but I don't think average people are riding this bus. Based on the view, it's us and about 40 other whites, so I don't think uh, they really took Westerners into consideration when they built this bus. So. I can't really even go this way because first world problems like the armrests in the way. Like on other buses, at least in Nepal, you can pull this up and then I can put my legs out this way. So basically, as my friend Albi would say, I'd be, I'm stuck like sitting like a mermaid basically. So I'm comfortable. <laughs> okay, we're at our first stop of the day. Normally we've been stopping for lunch or for dinner, but since we left about 7.30, the normal stop area is at the time of breakfast. Not really hungry, but it's a good idea to go to the bathroom. So we're gonna go do that. And I'm really like drowsy, like the motion sickness is, is great. It's super helpful and I'm glad it kicked in before um, we got sick or anything like that, but you get really, really tired. So I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick and then just gonna come back and rest some more. Every time you see a river now, are you going to think that there's a elephant or a rhino in there? Uh, no, I'm going to think there's a alligator with a really skinny nose. Hmm. I forgot what they're called. Goral? Goral, yeah, yeah. Those are very interesting. Reminds me of a joke. What do you get when you cross an elephant with a rhino? A mess. Elephino? Get it? Elephino? Hell if I know. Uh. <laughs> I led us to the bus, but the bus is not even open yet. He's <laughs> like, you got 25 minutes, but that's, you know, we started off on a bad foot today because he's like, oh, we're not gonna leave till 8 a.m. And then at 7.38, he was leaving. So now I have trust issues with him. Mm, true. So I'd rather be here early, <laughs> even though we had a nice little lunch spot by the river, but um, I don't want to get left again. Mm -hmm. When I was getting left this morning, did you even say, hey, hold up? Or you're well, just he, like, whatever happens, happens. No, 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 he asked, where's where's, where's your friend? And I said, bathroom. I don't know why I said bathroom, it was just easier to say, but right. yeah. But then he still started pulling away. So I'm like, what? what? If we leave him, we leave him. If he dies, he dies. Well, as I was entering back into the parking lot, I was like, all right, the bus is moving, this is not good. So I was like, literally like running to the front. So I was like, if he does leave, at least he's gonna run me over. So maybe he wouldn't leave, but it all worked out. Yeah. And uh, lunch is only 600 rupees total. So mm -hmm. just a couple of bucks. So even though we don't have, didn't have the money, we were still able to afford it. But yeah. when we get back to town, we we'll definitely need to get some more money. Yeah. I think we're halfway there. Should be more than halfway there. I feel like we left at 7.30. Now it's like, what, 1.30? Yeah. But th this halfway. has been the smoothest trail so far, right? Because we haven't gotten on like the edge of the mountain and stuff like that. There's been some traffic, but yeah. as far as bumpiness and the road quality, the Actually, first hour was like really hot though, because oh, yeah. there's no air or the window. Yeah. Windows down. He did have it off, but the rest of the ride has been on it. Like I got cold. I had to put my hands on my sleeves and my shirt. <laughs> All right, hopefully next stop is back in Kathmandu. Mm -hmm. As we expected that took about nine hours um, first half flew by pretty well uh, I think the seats are comfortable it's much better if you're short unlike me so I really couldn't get 
too relaxed because I had to bend and twist in different ways to sit in the seat. Now, if you could take that seat off and put it into your apartment, then you're a business. But the problem is the seats are way too big for the bus. Like they have the same size bus, but then the seats are like two times the size. So that was a little bit rough, but it feels good to be back in Kathmandu. And we just enjoyed all of our time here in Nepal. Right, uh, right. <laughs> Not That's possible? One way. Oh, one way. It's one way? Uh, yeah. yeah, the maps doesn't tell you that. We've <laughs> done it before. Yeah. Okay, round. Okay, go around, yeah. Yes. Okay, sorry, but I Google maybe. Maps doesn't show that. Big problem. <laughs> Google Maps doesn't show one way. So looks like we're back on track now. <laughs> yeah, he just had to go to the street over. That's one way. Okay. Here is good. Yes, a little bit more. Yeah, right here. Purple. Right here. Good, good. This one. Yeah. Yay! We did it! <laughs> we made it back and this is actually the very first apartment we stayed in when we first got to Kathmandu, so it feels like we're back home. Thank you so much for watching this video. This is Weedy Travels. What, what could possibly, possibly be next? next?